Hey gang, Jack Lair here. Uh, just a quick video on uh, Dinner Live Extreme Beach Volleyball. I picked this up and I had never played it. Always heard about it, but just uh, had never gotten around to it. Um, the basic premise is if all right, Dead or, Dead or Alive is a very weird series. Let's go with that. And it's bonkers. But the basic premise is that Zach and Nikki, Zach and his, just, they find a bunch of treasure. Zach buys an island. And then he invites all of the women from the Dead or Alive series to come hang out at the island and play volleyball. So there are a bunch of different, uh, there's an accessory shop where you can buy uh, all kinds of uh, nonsense, uh, hair piece, hair things, uh, suntan lotion if you don't want, because the characters will actually tan if they spend time out in the sun. Uh, there are different kinds of balls, there are uh, bangles, sneakers, sunglasses, all kinds of weird stuff. There's the sports shop, which is basically where you buy all of the different outfits. Uh, and if you know the Dead or Alive series, they're, this is par for the course. They love dressing up their, their characters, uh, both the men and the women. There's Zack of All Trades, which opened up. I don't know what this is. It seems a little nuts, but we've got a steering wheel, pen and ink. I'm pretty sure these are specific things you can give the girls. Because basically, you play as one character. Right now, I'm playing. Um, I'm teamed up with Hitomi. And I just decided to play Kasumi since Kasumi's ostensibly the main character of the game. So there's uh, a few different things that you can do, and it, it changes, it goes day by day. As you can see, I'm in day seven. The reason I'm at day seven is because originally I started to play this but it has all kinds of licensed music so i had to go into the radio station and all the music that you're listening to right now is from the youtube's library that doesn't require annotation or so they say so uh and then there are the different places that you can go right now the tide's in so we can't play on bass island but we can play jungle basically this is a two button game and so you can give presents, you can partner with people, but we're gonna play. Um, Helena is the is teamed up with my old partner, so kind of want to show him up. And basically, like I said, you've got two buttons. Uh, you move around, and. B is a light tap, and A is your assault kind of button. Nope. Come on. Come on. See, unfortunately, Hatomi is the... Ah. Hatomi is the stronger character. So she should really be up front, but unfortunately it's just not working out that way. Uh. Set her up. 
<laughs> I missed the button. Oh yes, everyone is very polite as well. Except when you start losing. Ah, crap. Getting smoked here. Uh, so I don't I don't know this is true sorry this is So, uh, I forgot what I was saying, but no, I missed it. gonna lose here and then she's gonna leave me i'm gonna feel bad I mean, after i bought her a cool hair thing and everything and see now i lost and these are the the little currency is zach dollars apparently he decided his own see and there's nobody I can rematch against them, but I'll probably get destroyed. I'll probably get destroyed no matter where I go, but. Because this game is. So, the if anybody remembers, the Xbox has pressure sensitive buttons, which is super weird. Like, the face buttons are analog. There we go. So if you push the button too soon, she jumps up, and then she'll start doing attacks. Ugh. See, I pushed it too early, and she just kind of, uh. Not the button I wanted. There we go. It's it's all timing based, and it's basically just: do you want to pass it to the other person, or do you want to send it back over? Ah! I don't need to replay. I know how. I know how bad I suck. See. Push the button too soon. Okay. Hi. Wrong button. There we go. Hi. Much better. <laughs> Push the button too soon. Hi. 
Nice save, Hitomi. <laughs> no! Tell me. She's not helping. She's about to get fired. Script the serve. Don't script the serve. No. <laughs> Try a little harder next time. Aww. Okay, let's play. Let's play at Nikki Beach. See if I can win here. Named after Zach's girlfriend. Good Lord. Tina and I might, I mean, everybody else might as well not be here. Okay. <laughs> I did. You don't have to show the reply. Hey, Tina. She's, ru she's ruined me in every game that I've been against her, so. Okay, set up. Spike. Nope. <laughs> Did you see how she just knocked me down? Hi. 
So then you come to the hotel. Uh, Zach gives you a present. It's a present from Zach. And you can unlock all kinds of cool stuff. Uh, some stuff I can't show you because it ruins the capture device. But so let's see. Let's go to view items. Oop, wrong button. And you've got the swimsuits. You've got accessories. So for instance, I wanted to... And if you keep them, they go to your collection. And these are what I can't show. So I just automatically put them in the keep file. These are the presents. You can open them yourself or you can give them to people. Since I am terrible at this game, I always make a gift and give them to the person that I am teamed up with. Like I know that Hitomi likes the color blue, so I give her blue things whenever I can. So like here's the collection, their accessories and items. Like I'm just saving all these. I've now got the black sneakers stored away. And then you go to bed and the day starts over. So. Me too. Me too, Kasumi. Oh. See, now I'm on my own again. And I'm going to spend days trying to get people back. Wow, my two former partners have teamed up. That's harsh. But there you go. Uh, brief little look at uh, Dead or Alive Extreme Beach Volleyball. Um, I'm terrible at the game. I want to get better, but I think I need to go into... Oh, 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 I forgot to... I don't even know how to get there. Nope. Oh, does that? Yeah, you can only quit at nighttime, by the way. So, but um, that's all I got. Thank you very much for watching.